Good morning, everyone. We have a little bit of a baby situation happening this morning. I actually just recorded this hair tutorial um, for my IG Reels, so I am going to link it for you guys in case you want to see how I achieve this look. You can check that out. Usually, I like to wave my hair when my hair is dirty. Um, literally, I don't have the heart to wave my hair when my hair is fresh like clean then i have to wash it within a couple of days because i only can stand this hair for like 48 hours but anyway i did my hair got ready for the day i actually have like a little bit of a peachy makeup on which i really really like and i got dressed for the day which i'm gonna show you guys the full outfit in a second um but yesterday i went to my friend's house got home really really late and this morning i woke up with the biggest biggest headache I haven't had a wine hangover in a very, very long time. Let me actually talk to you guys like this, then I'll show you guys my outfit. But yeah, I haven't had a wine hangover in a very, very long time and it's not pretty. I woke up with a pounding headache, like a pounding headache. Um, I usually don't take medication, but I had to take a medication for my headache. And last night we had a sparkly wine. And um, if you don't know, I had a um, weight loss surgery called duodenal switch three years ago now. And one thing my stomach cannot handle is any fizzy bubbly drinks like sodas, champagnes and all of that. I can have like a glass of it here and there, but obviously I had plenty of it last night. So... Uh, my stomach was really really upset this morning so I'm a little bit delicate today um, but I have a very very fun day I have a little bit of errands um, that I need to run and then I'm meeting up uh, with one of my friends at one of my favorite restaurants called Pump that I haven't been in a very very long time um, so I dressed a little bit um, springy but still it's a little bit chilly outside so that's why i wore long sleeve um before i show you guys my outfit i want to show you guys i'm looking to see where i put it here it is i wanted to show you guys this item which is a razor electronic razor that literally saves my life so here it is um, obviously electric so you turn it on like this it has the trimmer and it has the razor here and this has been literally a lifesaver for me you know when you're dressed and you're about to leave the house and then you notice a hair here and there this has been phenomenal for that absolutely loving this i'm gonna link it for you guys got it off of amazon for like below 30 dollar and it has been a lifesaver um what i have on my lips in case you guys care it's like a peachy kind of situation i am wearing the charlotte tilbury angel alessandra and what is this one urban decay name drop gloss i'm actually wearing a nyx um, lip liner um i think it's called nude suede something like that i'm gonna link it for you guys and for perfume i'm gonna go in with my new perfume that i absolutely love, love. literally three spritz is enough one two and one on my hand and here is my ootd i am wearing uh, my amazon stack earrings my amazon um, necklace and then this bodysuit is from zara uh, my chanel um belt vintage chanel belt bottega dupe bag from amazon this skirt is from h&m and i love it it's very very much of a spring vibe and i'm wearing my fendi flats my feet are a little bit swollen so um that happens every time that i have a little bit too much wine um, but let's just ignore that they'll go down probably by end of the day hopefully um, and I have my um, Bulgari ring that I don't think you guys have ever seen it. I haven't worn it in like years, but the other day I rediscovered it and I've been obsessed with wearing it. And then my usual Van Cleef bracelets and this one, the butterfly one is Van Cleef and the chain one is Ice Link. I'm just gonna grab my um, YSL sunglasses and head out because per regular programming I am running late. A little different than all the rest. I quite old fashioned wear a hat sometimes play chess. And when I'm out, I'm looking for that vintage fling. But all complexions that I adore. So hard to find these seem impossible to score.
Oh my god, it is hot. I didn't think it would be this hot. I thought it's gonna be like breezy. I checked the weather, but it is really hot. I wish I wore short sleeve, but don't have time to go home and change. Um, I was just at gas station. I actually recorded what's in my bag because I was not doing anything. And I'm very, very curious to know what people carry in their bag. Um, so while I was waiting um, for the gas to be filled, um, I just did a what's in my bag. I'm gonna post it on my story in case you guys care what I carry. You can check that out. Kinda know where I'm going, but let's just put the address in just to be sure I'm going the correct way. Okay, I'm, I, I can be on time. 34 minutes. That's not bad. I'm really regretting wearing long sleeve, but as I said, it's too late to turn around and go home and change. Um, but let's just hope I'm not gonna bake. Just had lunch with my friend. By the way, their pasta, if you ever go to the pump restaurant, their pasta is just one of a kind. It's one of the, the, the most delicious pastas you will ever eat. It's angel hair pasta with chicken and it's just so, so, so good. Um, and obviously their cocktails are fabulous as well. So we finished um, lunch and she actually gifted me a few bits and bobs um, from the store that she works. I did do a little bit of a haul at the restaurant. I unboxed all the items that she got me. Um, I will link their store for you guys in the description box below. Good morning, everyone. Um, it is actually a couple of days after you guys saw me last. Just got ready for the day. Did this little bit of, I'm not sure if the camera is picking up on it because it's a little bit subtle, but we did a little bit of a peachy makeup. I'm very, very into peachy makeup currently. I don't know why. And I got dressed for the day and I have a very, very busy work day ahead of me, like a lot of admins and stuff. But before the chaos of the day starts i want to show you guys a few bits and bobs that i got and try on some clothes with you um i have items from asos i have items from h&m if you guys remember in my h&m haul was it two weeks ago yeah two weeks ago in my h&m haul i tried on items that i needed to size up in them so while i was putting an order to size up in my items i've bought few bits and bobs that are extra not that many uh, in my ASOS haul we have dresses, shoes and stuff and then I have a few, I'm looking at my packages, um, I have a few Amazon bits to show you guys, uh, home bits, not clothing. I have not tried down any of the clothes from ASOS or H&M so it's going to be an unboxing and try on haul together. We're gonna start off with ASOS and the first item, I know this is a very very surprising kind of a situation but it is this um, what is this called? Strapless. <laughs> Strapless dress that is poofy on the bottom. I'm thinking this is going to be a midi length. And the back is open. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. Uh, my cousin's um, 50th birthday is coming up. And it's going to be like a black tie kind of a situation. And I usually don't wear black. Not that you have to wear black at the black tie. I mean, like, it's going to be like a formal situation. Uh, but I usually don't wear black. And when I saw this dress, I just absolutely fell in love with the design of it um the fact that it's strapless the back is just a little bit open this detail of the buttons it's just was a very very cute 
kind of a situation i'm not obsessed about this material it's like a scuba material uh, but i thought i can even belt it like my chanel belt with my valentino shoes this could look cute um from the look of it i think this is going to be big on me because it seems stretchy i got it in a size us 10 so i'm just gonna give it a try and see how it um, fits on me but I really hope it works out because it's such a beautiful dress I didn't think I'm gonna love this dress but I am absolutely obsessed with this I don't wear black I don't wear like dresses in this shape but I love it I wish it was just a little bit shorter like it was midi since I am 5'4 this is literally ankle length for me absolutely love the back it's so cute just a little bit of a skin showing in the back and i think with gold jewelry it looks absolutely beautiful i don't think i'm gonna add the belt to it because i just feel like the dress will not look good in the back with the belt maybe a very thin belt might work but i think with only my valentino um black and gold sandals and like gold jewelry this will look fantastic I did order it in a size 8, this is a size 10, only because I feel like these areas I would keep pulling up, so I was like, let me just order size 8 just to try that and see how that will fit, because I don't like that you have to keep pulling this section up. So I'm just gonna wait until the size 8 arrives, just so see how it sits on this area, because the material of it is super stretchy, I think the size 8 will work just a little bit better on these areas and I don't have to keep pulling it up. Oh my god, this is so adorable. I'm not sure if this could be a spring or summer just because of the texture of it. It's like this tweed material that I think looks fantastic during fall and winter, but it could work out for um, summer and spring, but I don't think this will fit me. But it is this gorgeous, gorgeous dress with the pearl details on it. Um, this is from Another Stories, which I don't think I've ever had anything from them. And this is in a size, let's see, it says UK 18, Euro 44. It doesn't have the US size, but I'm usually, a, um, yeah, it doesn't have the US sizing on it. I'm usually a size 12 or 14 with white top this will look very very gorgeous and chic obviously not with this top but it's a very very cute um skirt unfortunately it doesn't come lower than this and it is a little bit too short for my liking but it's a very very cute skirt i'm just so annoyed that it doesn't fit me nicely um it's I like a high-waisted kind of situation, but it's literally up to here and it doesn't come lower than um, this. Basically on my hip area, it does not fit. Um, I wish it was just a little bit longer than it would have been like skirt up dreams. Absolutely love it and I'm very, very upset that unfortunately I have to return it. Oh God, this is so colorful and I am here for it. Um, Look like how beautiful these colors are. So it is a strapless, very see-through dress. This is, I got it from mostly as a swimsuit cover-up, pool party, you wear it on top of your bathing suit kind of a situation. I mean, you can wear it at and about if you would like to, um, but the back is completely open like literally completely open it just has this strap to keep the sides together and then it's all the way until the bottom of it it has a little bit of ruching on the side it's a very very cute dress i just absolutely fell in love with the colors of it like this is how i can do colorful when there are like pastel muted colors i mean they're bright but not in a tacky way i don't know the combination of the colors work fantastic i just love a pink and green together and obviously this peach i'm very into peach it's just the color combo was everything so i'm hoping this is gonna fit me this is a on brand and it is us 12. this is probably one of the sexiest dresses that i have ever worn but i'm here for it i absolutely love 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 it as i mentioned i'm not gonna wear this as and about this is going to be like a pool party over bathing suit kind of a situation and um, I mean, 
not even over the bathing suit i wouldn't mind wearing this at a pool party or that kind of a situation or like a beach but this is not a dress that i would be comfortable wearing at and about because it's super short the back is literally completely open i wouldn't i wouldn't feel comfortable uh, but i would 100 percent wear this at the beach or summer vacation at the beach or a pool party i just adore this dress and this is the size 12 of it size 14 was a little bit too big on this area so i'm just gonna hold on to the size 12 um, for the pool parties to come i love love a high-waisted paperback kind of a situation so i saw these beige pants that have that like paper bag kind of a waistline and it comes with its own belt the color is perfection in my closet it is pretty much a straight leg kind of a situation i got this in a size this is from miss selford and i got it in a size us 12 i really hope it fits me because it's such a beautiful beautiful pants and even with this top that i'm wearing right now it could look very cute it's just a good um spring and summer pants to throw on it's lightweight it has pockets it has the cinched in waist and obviously because of the color of it it can go with so many clothing i just really hope it fits me because i think this was the only size that they had available do i wish the hip area was just a little bit looser so this area was not pushed like pulling yes but i'm gonna hold on to this because i really really like it it is super lightweight so comfortable it's just i wish this was a little bit bigger on these areas so it was not pulling as much because as you guys can i'm not sure if you guys can see but yeah it is pretty visible these areas are just a little bit tight and i did a horrible job with my bow but just imagine a pretty bow here um that's so funny because a few days ago i was um posting in my robe and my bow was like very ugly all over the place and then um somebody messaged me they're like i would imagine you're one of those people who knows how to tie a perfect bow i'm like you could you could have not been more wrong i'm one of those people who can never tie a pretty bow literally um but yeah besides the point um yeah this is a little bit too tight on me so i'm gonna see if they have a bigger size which i doubt it because i remember when i was shopping they only had it in size us 12 and i was like oh my god perfect that's my size but um yeah this areas of it is a little bit tight on me and it is pulling if they don't have a size of 14 probably i'll hold on to this one because i really really like the feet of it and yeah but if they do have size 14 i'm gonna give the bigger size a try if not then i'll hold on to this one because i really really like it this is a little bit too childish and <laughs> now that i see it i mean it could look cute but it can be childish as well um so i got a white bow with pearls and diamonds i just love it this needs a stem obviously for it to just stand up but it is so cute just imagine it like here is it too childish i don't know i really like bows i just think they're cute <laughs> i don't like bows on my clothing mostly but i really like bow design in my hair next up i have a pair of flats like ballerina flats it's actually from aldo which i didn't know it's from aldo i didn't pay attention um i got them off of sale and they remind me very much of chanel flat shoes the beige and black combination with the bow uh, i just really hope it fits me doesn't this remind you of the chanel shoes the chanel one is a little bit rounder this one has a little bit of a square of a toe very very cute classic shoes that will work great for spring summer winter fall they're just a, like a classic design then i was looking for um a little bit of an extra poolside kind of a, a sandal and now that i look at it they're very pretty but i don't think they would be practical because they're literally made out of plastic but all the poolside sandals are made out of plastic if these are under the sun they're probably gonna burn my feet but anyway here they are they're so 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 cute they're like embellished with flowers and pearls and all of that and they're clear so obviously they can go with a lot of um, bathing suits i just really like the design of them um, they seem abnormally like narrow in this area 
Um, and I got these in a size USA 9. Um, they're very, very cute, but I feel like if these are under the sun, they would literally burn my feet. And these were another pair um, that I saw that were like beige and with the pearl detail. I got them in USA 8. Um, and I'm not sure if you guys can see, but it's literally bended. I'm sure when you wear it, it's gonna um, form into your feet because those are literally plastic. Do you guys see how they're bent? How weird is that? <laughs> but anyway, um, I just thought these are good basic um, sandals to have that will go with everything. We all know I love, I wear a lot of pearl. I love pearl and I just thought this would look cute for like poolside. I really, really like the design of this. So even if they burn my feet just a little bit, I think I should be okay with that. <laughs> Next up we have H&M. Everything is white and beige besides this. The rest of them, all white and beige. So I'm just gonna start out with this one very very cute dress love the color of it love 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 this design of the dress it's just comfortable hugs your body um from the look of it um the length of it is not going to be too short but again i'll try it on um i got this in a size us extra large i think just because it was stretchy material i didn't want it to be too like um body con so i just wanted it to be just a little bit relaxed so it's comfortable and love 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 the sleeve detail obviously it needs a really good steam but i really hope this works out because it's such a cute cute dress love the color of this but i do not love the fit of it i know if i size down in it then it will be too short and too snug and then i'm not gonna like that but it's just i don't know it's not flattering in my opinion the fabric is a little bit too thin which is perfect for summer but um, when it's too thin, that, feel, that feels flimsy. I'm not about it. Unfortunately, this will be a return. These are the only colorful stuff as well, so I'm just gonna show them to you guys. Um, these are basically um, head scarves. Got them in two different packs. This one is like more of a pinkish, reddish, purplish, and white one. And then this one is blue and light blue. The blue one with the orange and like yellow. It's not yellow, it's green actually. Flowers. Just thought it would look very cute with summer outfits. The love of white and beige shorts is astronomical. So I had to get this one as well, which is a white pair of high-waisted shorts with like a thick band. I got this in a size large and a medium. I just wanted to try it out and make sure like I like the fit of it. Um, these are really, really short. So I don't think I'll be comfortable wearing this out and about. Um, these are more like a bathing suit cover up like beach vacation kind of a situation for me um, but again we'll try it on and see um, which size fits me better obviously no matter how many times you steam these pants they're still going to be a little bit wrinkly but i just love 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 these pants they're so comfortable this is a size large and it fits fantastic love how high-waisted it is it's just fantastic for like a pool day on vacation out and about casual day at home like literally the ways you can wear these um, shorts are endless and I really like the length of it I thought it would be too short on me but it is an acceptable length and for my liking I'll for sure be keeping this because um, there is so many ways that I can wear this this dress was actually one of the dresses in my previous haul as well i just absolutely fell in love with the design of it the fabric of it and every like little detail the sleeve the stretchy material the ruchings and everything i find it very very flattering um and i just love 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 these dresses for um spring and summer i just think you can dress them up or down and that's what i love about them uh, the other one that i had was just a little bit small on me um and it had a defect in the Back, so I sized up in it. This is actually in size extra large. Really hope this will fit me nicely because I just absolutely love, love, love this dress. As I expected, the extra large fits just a little bit better and it is a little bit more comfortable. Love everything about it. The sleeve, the design, the length. It is just a little bit short, but I mean, not too short, but I would prefer it to be, to be just a little bit longer. But even this length, absolutely love, love, love it. You can wear it with like sneakers, 
um, or sandals for daytime and wear it with like heels and like a cute clutch for nighttime. I just love pearl jewelry with it. I just love everything about this dress. Another item that was in my previous haul that I absolutely loved it, but it was um, small on me. So I got this in a size extra large. It is this ribbed material, pretty much like midi dress with short sleeve, round neck. The back is just a little bit more open. This is extra large and I really hope this fits me. Just a basic dress to have. Um, for um, spring and summer on a night out or even during the day on a night out you can pair it with belt or heels and during the day it can be um, a casual look with sandals and sneakers no matter what size i try in this dress it's just not gonna work out this is the extra large and it just i still don't like the fit of it i don't like this area i just find it unflattering don't like the length of it, don't like how it, like, there's extra fabric, fabric here, but then the hip area is tight, so I'll be returning this. I really, really like the idea of this dress. I just think it's a perfect dress for spring and summer, like nighttime, when it's a little bit chilly, but yeah, it is just not working out, so I'll be returning this dress. That was everything that I got from H&M. And now let's get into the uh, Amazon packages. So I'm planning on doing a Mother's Day brunch kind of a situation and um, I needed a few bits and bob for my tablescape. Probably by the time you guys are seeing this video, the reels of it or like pictures of it is already up on my Instagram. Um, but I'm just gonna show you guys the items here and just like the thought process behind them. Not everything here is actually for Mother's Day. Some of them are like for our house, like just generally speaking, we needed it. Uh, but I'll mention which one is for Mother's Day. Um, we're gonna start off with this little they're not so little, but like these glasses. I don't know why I called it little. Um, these are champagne glasses and they're coming in a pack of eight, which usually, I don't know if you guys have the same problem as me, all the glasses either come individually or they're pack of four. I rarely come across pack of eight glasses. This made me very, very, very happy. But the reason that I got this is not for champagne. I personally like to have champagne um, in actual champagne glasses, the ones that are like lifted i don't know what are they called um i got this to use as a waist so my theory of putting the tablescape is these are all theories just don't quote me on it because i don't know if it's gonna work out or not but i wanted super thin vases that have like a thin top bought two packs of these so basically i have 16 um glasses that i can put like just few flowers and make like a table runner with this so that's the idea that i had in mind for these glasses um i just was having really hard time to find um glasses not glasses vases that were like narrow on top and i really really like the height of this because if you put flowers on top of it it would pretty much be this tall and i just didn't want it to be too distracting so when people are sitting from like across from each other they can actually see each other so that's why i needed something thin like this um height so with the flowers it's not too high and it's not like too distracting and i was not able to find any vases that size so i came across these glasses and i really hope it's gonna work out these are not for mother's day but i just find this very very cute we use um like one of those big tongs um, for salad or even like pastries and stuff. And I wanted some dainty ones. I came across these ones on Amazon. And I just thought these are super cute, super dainty. You can use it for salad. Um, you can use it for like pastry. You can just like use them for so many things. And I just really, really like the fact that it was gold and so dainty i'm trying to open up this foil so i just think the size of it is really really good and i don't know it has a really good grip so love this i got a pack of eight of these snack chips um ours were all plastic and colorful and i just didn't like them they were not a vibe so i got this super chic gold ones that are pretty 
heavy duty as well and now all of our snacks can have a cohesive clip on them <laughs> i saw these glasses they come in a pack of six and i just fell in love with it how beautiful are these glasses are they what are they called crook glasses i think so um this looks a little bit dusty but <laughs> that's fine i have to wash them obviously before i use them but i just fell in love with the shape of this love this kind of situation you can have champagne in these you can have cocktails in them so i just thought they will look very very cute for like mother's day we had a few of these but um like our pack was a six but uh, three of them broke we only had three of it left so we needed a new um what do you call it set so i got um, two packs of this which each pack comes in six so we have 12 of it which is plenty and just thought they're super super cute and chic next up i got just a regular pink table runner i absolutely love 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 these table runners uh, i'm gonna try to make a table runner with the flowers um like not put any kind of fabric but then if i see if it's too bare i'm gonna use this underneath the vases and the candles i just wanted it to have a pink theme so i got a pink one and it was super inexpensive as well that is everything that i've got i am surrounded with boxes and plastic wraps i'm going to clean all of this up and then i'm getting really really hungry i'm just gonna quickly have lunch and get to my work feeds because in just two and a half hours i have a nail appointment i'm finally changing up my nails i had these nails for like i think three weeks three and a half weeks and they're a little bit too grown out um like they're really grown out um i still don't know what kind of design i'll do but i'm excited to change my nails i may or may not have just woken up from a nap I had so many work things to do, but I don't know why all of a sudden I started not feeling well, which I have to go get checked out because I have been, like my blood sugar have been dropping a little bit frequently recently. I don't know why, out of nowhere I will feel like dizzy and my blood sugar will drop, my hands will go cold, my feet are cold. Um, and I used to get like that, but like not all the time. Um, but now randomly, especially if I'm tired or I'm overwhelmed, that would happen. I don't know what that is. So I need to call my doctor and go do some like blood work to figure out what's going on. So I started not feeling the best. So I literally laid down and didn't do all the pile of the work that I was supposed to do. So I'm just gonna go to my nail appointment after my nail appointment i have to go to a meeting and then when i get home i have to work pr pretty much until dinner time and um for dinner i am actually going out with my cousin and my mom which i'm very 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 much looking um forward to it i just left the salon and here are my very cute floral nails i just want to show you guys my because they just look so cute.